welcome to my channel. My name is Nini, and today I will be sharing with you my first part of what I got my kids for Christmas. Today I will be show solely sharing what I got my son. A little about my family. We are a family of five. My son is the only boy and he is seven years old. One of the things that my husband and I do is we will get each of our children their big ticket item. And also, we will also put things in their uh, stockings. My son is also allergic to nuts. So a lot of people that will put like candy in their kids' bags and chocolate. I can't do that with my son because of his allergies. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, one of the first things that I picked up for him were a few, this is for his stocking, a few of these Nerf guns. Now, the reason why... I thought these were a good pickup was because a Nerf gun can cost like $40, $50, $60. And he asked for one and I'm like, I'm not spending $60. Especially on something that I mean, he would only be playing by himself if it was I was to buy one for $60. I found these at Walmart. They were $6.88. I got three. I don't know what the other one is right now, but I have three children. So I bought three so that my son can get something that he wanted. And he can also play with his sisters. And they also had right there on the aisle, the Nerf aisle, they had a coupon for $10 off of 20 So that's also why uh, we got three of them so that I could utilize that coupon. And it worked out. He got what he wanted and I got mommy got to save money. What I will also be placing in his um, stocking is here. I'm actually going to put these in uh, the girls' stockings too. This is also from Walmart. Walmart. From Walmart. <laughs> this is Cord Bites. And what it is is kind of self explanatory. It is like a little rubber cover that goes over the pull part of your cord for your iPads, iPods, and what have you. My kids have iPads. Um, this will also help. Um, identify whose iPad cord is whose so that they're not fighting over that who has the messed up cord. This will help alleviate that problem. Um, so these were also, I think these were like $4. You'll find these in like the little bins where they have um, like the generic Apple products. I will say do not use, if you can, do not use the generic Apple products because they can sometimes either overcharge your uh, battery and you'll have even more problems afterwards. So that's why stuff like this to help protect like the <clears throat> the chargers, it was, a, I felt like this was a good pickup, especially for the kids. Now, on to the big ticket item. My son's first thing on his list and what he wanted as his big item was the Nintendo Switch. Now, the Nintendo Switch that I actually found for him is the Mario Kart Edition. This was a Black Friday release. Uh, the reason why this is so special and a good deal is it's the same price as the original Switch, but the Mario Kart game comes already loaded on the uh, system. So I saved like $70 by picking up this particular one. Uh, because it was a special release, you it, you may have a hard time finding it, but I would say they're specifically at Target. Um, if you can find by the UPC number at Target, and also, what's the name of that site? Brickseek is one of the sites, and I forget the other one. If I remember, I'll, I'll leave it in the description box. But you can actually pull up the inventory of the stores around you. What I will say is, because it's the holidays and a lot of people may be already doing this, is when you see it, go to the store. Don't call because, you know, it, it's the holiday season. The, the staff are doing an amazing job at the stores. And as you can imagine, everyone is not nice. So just go in and be gracious. And when you're asking about uh, the Mario Kart game, and you never know, maybe someone will find it for you. That's just my little two cent about the holidays is be nice to people who work in retail because I used to work in retail and let me tell you, around the holidays, people, <laughs> People can be people. I'll just leave it like that. 
But um, to protect my investment, the next gift that I got for my son is an actual case for the Nintendo Switch. If you do not know, the Switch is a handheld uh, system that can also connect to your television. I was told by um, the team member at Target that you can also, I believe, um, load Netflix to your Nintendo Switch, which is why I then picked up a memory card for my son because by having things like Netflix on his Nintendo Switch it will take up some of the memory so the memory card comes into play so that it won't he'll have the space to have his games and he'll also have the space for like if he wants to watch his little his little movies um my son is he's a very bright boy He's, he's nerdy, just like I want him to be. <laughs> so, mommy doesn't mind that he's into his little games and gadgets and stuff. That's fine. He's being a boy. Um, the next thing that I picked up for him is a screen protector kit. Did I mention that these items are all under... Um, this, I believe, this was $15. Oh, another thing about these cards. If you are picking up... Uh, memory cards for the Nintendo Switch you do not have to only get the Switch cards which are when, when I say Switch cards they have cards that come in the same exact packaging but they have the Nintendo characters on them as long as it's a SanDisk memory card it's completely the same thing I would double check when you're in the store to make sure you're getting the correct SanDisk uh, memory card but you can't you do not have to get the ones with the characters on them they're a lot more for a lower gig so that's just a little tip for you did i say what this is oh this is a screen protector for the uh, nintendo switch obviously to protect the screen but i want to say this was under ten dollars as well it comes with a wipe and like that little triangle thing to help you put the screen protector on Again, protecting my investment. And last but not least, I thought this was super cute. Um, it's a deluxe wheel attachment for my son's uh, Nintendo Switch. The Mario Kart game is a driving game. And this is just something super cute. He didn't have to have it, but again, he's a good boy. And I just thought, again, it's under $10 and I know he'll enjoy it. So yes, gifts under $10, always a plus, plus, plus. And that is all that I have for my son this year. Hopefully you enjoyed. Uh, please comment below if you enjoyed this haul. Also, let me know if there's anything that I'm missing that is, again, under 10 or within that threshold that you think my son may like. And I would love to hear from you. I'm new to YouTube, so please join my family, and I'll be welcome to join yours. And thank you for watching. Oh, and come back, because I will be bringing to you what I got my kids for Christmas for my girls. And they got a lot of hot ticket items, too. So I would love to see you come back. Click below, like, share, comment, subscribe. Like, share, comment, subscribe. 